What's up guys, it is your boy Techout Ratchet and today I'm bringing you guys a short commentary. Um, the gameplay in the background is um, just a normal gameplay, nothing great. Went on my specialist bonus like twice. Um, it's not about the gameplay though, this video I just want to talk to you guys about the next generation consoles. And a little bit of, about the gameplay. Um, I'm sorry there won't be any game sound uh, because um, when I was recording with my Elgato Game Capture HD, um, I by mistake switched on the live commentary um, feature so you could hear me rage in the background and I don't want to show that unless you guys request me and <laughs> want to watch me rage which I don't think so and here I got a pretty beast streak um short streak I mean I could have converted but some BS always kills me and you guys will see that um I get killed by a guard dog so Guard dogs are really overpowered in this game if you guys haven't realized till now. So yeah. What what I'm gonna be talk I'm playing on the PS4 obviously, the next generation consoles, the epic I mean like the graphics are amazing. They're like ten times better. The textures, the guns, in 1080p they look amazing. Almost like P I mean like PC gaming exactly. Um uh, the textures, yeah, everything. So Basically what from what I've gathered all this time is that the Xbox one looks Just a little bit um Not a P PlayStation fanboy, but it just looks uh, It just looks a little bit Yeah, it just it looks a little bit worse than the PlayStation 4 uh, Mainly because of the fact here I get killed by the stupid dog. Okay. Yeah, mainly because of the fact that um the Xbox uh, One outputs in uh, 720p native resolution while the PS4 outputs in 1080p native resolution. Uh, that's probably why the PlayStation 4 looks much better than the Xbox One. But in the future this may change for different games. So right now that's a condition. Um, the Xbox One is more like a home entertainment system. You can connect your back of your setup box to it um and yeah probably you can have the back of your setup box and it's like you can watch tv you can there's a snap feature which is pretty good in my opinion so overall i think the xbox one is better than the ps4 in terms of additional features other than gaming like the tv uh, the snap feature multitasking um the social aspect i think the playstation 4 the social aspect is a uh, much much better than the PlayStation 3 you can have cross game or uh, cross part uh, cross game parties um, which wasn't there on the PS3 was there on the Xbox 360 but wasn't there on the PS3 that is a big jump and the PlayStation Network uh, since you have to pay for it obviously connections much better um because you pay um, annual membership uh, fee for PlayStation Plus but the good part of the PlayStation Plus is that you get a free game every month so of course after you buy the membership um that's a really good deal and yeah now let's move on to the controllers i think the playstation 4 controller is amazing so basically it's it's not it's not small like the ps3 controller many people said that the ps3 controller was too small and it was for small asian girls but Right now, the I mean, the controller of the PS4 is amazing. It has um, the concave analog sticks, which I feel once you get used to it from the PS3 or coming from the PS from the PS3, is from a guy coming from the PS3. Um, yeah, so they feel much. You you you're probably more accurate with them. I feel you're more accurate with them uh, with the control sticks um, when they're concave. So that's pretty good, but the layout is the same exact same as the playstation 3 obviously um it's been like that from the ps2 times and maybe in the ps1 i'm not sure about that i'm not a great playstation fan but i don't know the history and stuff so if i get something wrong just don't blame me um i'm really sorry yeah so i'm not going to talk about much about stats and the graphical performance because there are many other youtubers who do that uh and i don't think you guys would be interested in it um yeah, overall, I feel your choice in the Xbox One and the PS4 
depends mostly on uh, like which controller do you prefer both are amazing uh where most of your friends are on and which you which console you've had in the past supposing you've had the ps3 and you're used to the playstation kind of controller uh, layout then i suggest you go with the playstation 4 i mean the playstation 4 is amazing it's already have an edge on the xbox one because it looks much better because it has 1080p output um natively uh on call really goes and mostly all the games um yeah then second is the exclusives like which exclusives do you prefer do you prefer the exclusives bought fr uh, from sony or the exclusive from uh, microsoft um and thirdly uh how is the after sales service in your country in india um the xbox and uh, no, not many people have it um and the uh after sales service or oh, their dead eye goes to work i don't know whether i've timed my yeah okay so i think that's it for the video so after sales service in india is much better so that influences your choice um that's it for the video i think i've run out of gameplay so i'll see you guys in my next video hopefully you enjoyed this short commentary i'll see you guys i'm out peace